Hey everyone, this is a quick tutorial on how to use the AHA COVID-19 Professional Forum. So first I'd like to navigate to this page. This is professional.heart.org and this is actually the COVID-19 Resource Compendium page. So if you scroll down here, you'll see under Professional Support is a link to the forum. If you have not done so yet, you can register here and join now. And then if you'd like to see um, a shortened version of this video and just a PDF guide, you can click here on how to get started. So for the purposes of this video, I'm assuming that all of you have already registered. So you would go ahead and click on this site. Um, I would highly recommend bookmarking this page if you would like. And if you're not logged in, you would go up here um, to click log in. So since I am already logged in, I'm just going to go to my account. And I will show you a few things on here. So first, you can update your username um, to something different. I know you had to choose something when you registered. But I would recommend you know, a first name and um, some other distinguishing feature. Please do not use AHA unless you are AHA staff. We would like to differentiate who is moderating and who is our staff and then who are other professional members. Um, any of this can also be updated. Please do not update your primary condition. This should um, be listed as a member of the professional forum. If you change your primary condition, you will lose access to the forum. So the only thing I recommend changing is your username and possibly um, your address. Next is your privacy. Um, so just a reminder that anyone who is part of this forum um, has to create a username and so therefore becomes a member. So it's not a public page. There are hundreds if not thousands of members who are active on this page. Um, so personally, I um, like to protect my privacy a little bit more. So I do not want people to um, send me a separate comment onto my profile page. I want any conversations I have with people to be within the realms of this forum. Once again, that's up to you. If you'd like to change this to members, um, just click here, um, or you can just say no one. Also, you can check this box if you would like the American Heart Association to be able to contact you. To save your changes, just click here where it says update and that will change. Um, then over here for notifications. So I like to have more notifications on this just to know when people are saying things, um, you know, what's happening in the forum in general. So if you click these boxes, um, then you can get an email with an instant notification anytime there are new comments or anytime you follow a post in the forum. You can also opt to receive a digest of the activity that occurs in the community. So you can choose that on a daily basis or on a weekly basis. Once again, up to your preferences, you would just click here to update. Also, if you'd like to update your profile picture, initially it just starts off as a, a blank icon here, you would just click here on the plus button and navigate to your pictures and choose an appropriate picture you would like to represent yourself. And that would save. So now I'm going to show you the actual forum itself. So if you go up here to the right where it says special forums, you would click here, AHA COVID-19 professional forum, and that takes you to this whole news thread. So this is arranged chronologically. The most recent posts are up here and the posts from further back are down here. There are additional pages if you toggle down here. Um, this forum was started on April 8th, so feel free to go back and see what else is um, you know, what else was posted in the past. So as you can see here, um, users have the option to upload a PDF. So I'm clicking on this to view. So here's a PDF which was uploaded. You can also choose to download it here onto your personal computer so you can read at a later time or you can forward on to additional colleagues. Also, we have the option of embedding YouTube videos. So if you press here, it will start playing the YouTube video which is embedded or you can go out to a full screen. I need to exit out of full screen. All right, so I'm going to show you how to respond to other people um, within the forum first. So let's say, um, you know, we have this um, post here, this initial post, and there's a video. So we want to say something about the video and then um, post our own PDF. So we're only replying to this thread. We're replying to this user, L Prince AHA. So we're just doing test, test. 
And then, like I said, we're going to reply with a PDF of our own research. So I will go into my documents and I will choose a PDF that I can upload. So that is shown here. And then I would just go ahead and post. I'm not going to do this because I don't want to confuse people. So I'm actually going um, to cancel that for now. And now I'd like to show you how to enter YouTube code. So I have a YouTube video right here. I'd like to notate anything after the equal sign is the only part that we're taking. We're not copying the entire URL. So as you see, I'm just taking this highlighted part and copying it and I'm pasting it right in here. And then if I were to press post, it would show an embedded video just like the one above. So that is how you would follow, or how you would become part of a thread conversation with somebody else. I also want to note up here, if you click on this button, oops, sorry, I need to exit out of here. So I would like to show you that if you want to follow somebody, you need to go into the actual um, conversation and then you can just click follow here. And so that once again goes back to your um, notification settings of when you will be um, notified about the threads that you are following. So to navigate back to the main forum, which is right here. And now I'm going to show you how to start your own topic. So we encourage everyone to post a new topic about a question that they may have, research that they may have. I saw some other users posted some videos that they had already created. So we just ask that you create a topic title and then any, any sort of text you would like here. Um, as I mentioned, you're free to upload a YouTube video or a PDF. So that is the forum in a nutshell. I would just like to um, bring this onto the screen right now. This is in the guidelines that I referenced earlier, the PDF version. And I would just like to note that we created this professional forum to feel welcome, safe, and to have every single person participating to be respected. So all opinions are respected and valued. Um, we prohibit any post that discriminates, attacks, insults, shames, or bullies others. And also just a note that all posts should be HIPAA compliant. If you do have any questions or concerns, please contact, contact us at supportnetworkatheart.org. Thank you so much and please enjoy the professional forum.